All right, my throat still feels like I'm swallowing glass, but hey, the show must go on, just with probably a lot more cuts as I cough, blow my nose, drink water, all that good stuff. Goes along with how I'm feeling right now. Welcome to Future Escape. This is the tutorial where you learn the basic mechanics, make sure your Minecraft sounds are set high. You can open the vents, click to open them, jump, then jump in the air to go under them. Like using a light track, it can be really hard to get through, but there it is possible. Wait, what's open? You can open the vents. I guess that's open? So jump and then jump. Wait, do I have an elytra? Apparently. Hold on. Oh, okay, wait. Got, got it. Oh, that wasn't too bad. Maybe I'm better now because I'm sick. I'm gonna be like so focused on just getting things done that it's gonna go smoother than if I were in good health. Blocks with these particles above them can be pushed. Oh, nifty. All right, that's pretty cool. And, uh, all right, squirrel, let's start it up. Okay, so here we are. Oh, that's a crafting table. Very cool. We got a vent system there. Seeing if there are any gray stained glass that I need to be taking in there, you know. Uh, hype labs. So we got to escape hype labs. Apparently, I don't want to be here anymore. I don't know. Honestly, all I really want to do is just sleep in the bed. I'm totally fine being here for a while. Just let me recuperate a little bit. And then, uh... I'll escape when I'm feeling better. No? All right. Somehow we have to like use the vent system here to our advantage. I guess let's just do this. Wait. It's open, right? It's open. I want you to be open. Come on. There, there we go. All right, we're good. I just took, just took a moment. All right, there we go. We're, we're sprinting through these things. I have no idea where we're going, but it's war. Oh, there we go. Cool. Just. Takes a moment, you know, and then you figure it out. What do we got through Stop here? The alarms. The puny human is trying to escape. Wait, where did he go? That didn't sound like a very alarming alarm. It was like very calm. It's like, ah, dang, we had these escapes every week. Oh, well, it's fine. Just let them go. It's really not worth our... Wait, what the heck? How? Wait, that's seamless. Oh my, what the heck? Can I? Bruh, I'm freaking out here. What the heck? Hold on a minute. This is nuts. Wait, so it stays open now? No, now it's not. I am so confused. How did you do that? Oh, dude, it's like the code, except even nuttier. Put six, di six digit code here. Insert code. Okay. I need to figure out the codes. Oh, God. Is this going to be like the code map where I have to turn around and pivot backwards and do all this stuff to make things happen. Oh my god. One, two, three, four. We have to do a six digit code. If I go the, oh, okay, I saw, I saw some trickery go on right there, hold up. There's nothing in there if I, that's closed off. I see your secrets if I look at the proper angle. And that still says one, two, three, four. What if I do this? Okay. You don't want me walking backwards. I see. I see what you're doing there. Okay, now if I do this, I'm trying to figure out how I get the six digit code though. There's gotta be some other if I walk backwards. I'm trying to do all the things that I would do in the code, like walk backwards through everything and see if anything happens when I do that differently. I just run into the chest and get the same thing. Huh. I wonder if I go back through the vent now, if there's I, I probably have to get over there. I came from that side, right? If I go... Oh, there's not the quartz block there, so actually I can't go back. Anyway, I'm kind of stuck in this area, so there's got to be all the info I need in here. You know, obviously I'd have figured it out right now if it weren't for the fact that I'm sick. It's a little, little cloudy-headed, but otherwise, uh, you know, we'd be doing well. Wait, I, I just came back over, and uh, did, had I not opened the chest when this was open from this side? That's bizarre. Okay, because that's different. So I guess it's Two, three, four, six, seven, eight. That would make sense. Blame it on the swallowing glass whole deal. So uh, let's do our code here. We've got two, three, four, six, seven, eight. Should be good to go, I think. Moving right along. Hey, all right, not even a problem, dude. I'm escaping this lap just fine. You just, you just wait. All right, I'll tell you, when I'm not swallowing glass, nothing can hold me back. Here we go, let's move along. Is this an elevator?
I don't know why this just reminds me of some kind of like superhero Marvel movie scene. Just casual intermission in the middle of a battle when the heroes are on an elevator trying to do an escort mission. And then they have a casual encounter with one of the, uh, the bad guys. And it's like, oh, hi there. And then the elevator music stops and the fighting resumes. You know what I mean. You know the situation. It's yeah, absolutely. Okay. You'll never get past the guards. No, I'll definitely get past the guards. Just hold on a second. The guards would never come onto the elevator, would they? Okay, this is going to be a problem. Oh, okay. Turns around right there. The guard doesn't have the, uh... I go in here. Oh, that's a pretty sweet little broom clock. The guard can sense you if you're too close. Okay, that's just not fair. He, he can't see me if he's looking directly at me, but he can sense me. Does it turn around there? Oh, okay. Well... I'll just go to the back of the closet, then we should be good. And we we move along. Not a problem. That card's not very good at doing his job, honestly. I, I get the whole idea of being able to sense being pretty cool, but sight's pretty important, too. Sight travels further than two blocks, usually. So, all right, are we just trying to get him each in, in there and there? I mean, that seems pretty simple, right? One there. And then the other one over here, like, pretty, pretty not too bad. As long as I don't overshoot it. Easy. All right, what do we got? Sticks and more sticks. Oh, automatically makes a ladder when we have that many sticks in our inventory. That's pretty cool, dude. I wish it worked like that normally. Like I could just kind of think and then Minecraft would craft whatever is needed. They're making those things for computers where it'll be like a helmet that you wear and then you're supposed to be able to think what you want the cursor to do or whatever you're going for and the computer is just supposed to do it. God, can you imagine how useful that would be in Minecraft? You just, as long as you have the resources in your inventory, it just crafts it. Can't wait for the plug-in for Minecraft when it comes to that device. I'm sure exactly what it's meant for, right? You know, all the all the super cool applications of the brain-controlled computer thing. Let's use it for Minecraft. Put the seven sticks in here, as you wish. That's all I had to do. Fancy that. Very cool. Appreciate you. Did I, did I escape the lab? Using my primitive technology of seven sticks. Ah, oh, there we go. Sweet. That's a little word for. I can't wait to watch him try to get past the lava. I think I got this honestly. Hit all three bullseyes to lower the lava. You know, if you were really trying to not let people escape your thing, you probably shouldn't provide instructions right next to the trap that you know they're not supposed to get by. That's just like bad guy 101, right? But okay, I missed that one. I'm good at other things. It's fine. Being Legolas is never... Wait, I oh, I actually have to straight up hit the bullseye. That didn't count. I hit, like, within an inch of it, but there we go. Yep, as you said, can't wait to watch him get by the lava. I mean, you did get your wish. You said you couldn't wait. So, continuing right along... What do we got here? More computers? Nobody's really working on stuff here. Feels like all the employees also escaped, so... It's only fitting that the test subjects would, too. Like, no one was going to feed me otherwise. Really, it forced my hand here. Well, he got past the lava, but there's no way he can do parkour. I'll, I'll tell you what. If you really didn't want me to get past the parkour, all you had to do was, like, move that block over by one. And then I really couldn't have gotten past the parkour. It seems like you really actually want me, which is suspicious. You definitely want me to be able to get through all these tasks. So what have you got at the end? For? It's going to be like reverse psychology. Like actually all along, I intended for you to escape. This is just a psychology experiment. If I hold something away from you enough, you're going to want it. Whether or not you know if it's good for you. Okay, I'm really bad at this. I just, you know, I have depth perception problems when um, I am swallowing glass. Somehow it, it impacts my eyesight. It just, take my word for it. <laughs> All right, there we are. Nah, surely. Oh, yes. My favorite guard. He'll never get past Jerry. Really? <laughs> he won't? I mean, we're buds, actually, so I think I should be able to. Why would Jerry do anything to me? Oh! All right, hold on. Jer you're not the Jerry I remember, if I'm being honest with you. Wait a minute. Okay, so, hold up. You're gonna, are you gonna turn around now? Now we're good. Like, what happened to you, Jerry? You're looking a lot, I don't know, less green than I remember you. Anyway, okay, we've got a couple of vents. Looking forward to this vent situation again. Here we go. Oh, I got it mastered now. Don't you worry. Don't you worry. First try, boys. God, I'm so good at vents. Wait, do I want to? I don't know if I actually want to go down there. I do want to go down there. Cool. 
Don't tell me I went backwards doing that. I'm gonna be real. It appears as if the human is just crawling through the air ducts. Yeah, an astute observation. I am impressed. All right, do we go in here? Oh no, that's an iron door, so we're not. Uh, I guess we're doing more vent stuff, dude. Oh wait, I gotta open it. There we go. God, first try twice in a row. I'm just, I thought I was good. Turns out I'm not as good as I thought I was. There we go. All right, we're moving along now. Yeah, it does turn out, oh no, you just, you've turned it into a maze. That's what you've done. Have you done that? Wait, this looks familiar. Oh, okay, cool. I thought I just went back into the exact same spot I was at before. I was not going to be stoked about that. What do we got? What do we got? Just waiting for a guard to kind of pop out. Oh, wait, are you about to do that? Oh, God, that freaking seamless teleportation is just... Oh, man. I, it's... Confusing. Isn't it? Yeah, no, it is for sure. It's gotten even crazier than when I played the code way back when. I don't know how any of this works anymore. <laughs> oh, boy. You should be proud of that one. You should. God, I'm so good at the fence, though. There we go. Now we're good. Is it just the same vent maze combo? Wait. Am I in the same place again? No, this is different. Just still blue. God, do I have to walk backwards through things now? No, no, we're good. Okay, we're good. Just gotta push this along the path, and then I think we'll uh, we'll be out of here, right? Yeah. All is going smoothly. You've made this like pretty. Oh God, is it gonna do that? No, we're good. We're good. We're not doing any trippy, weird teleportation stuff. We're just pushing this along the path, and everything's good. I was about to be like, are you going to have me push a block along and also you're going to have teleportation? I don't even know how you would do that. Thank goodness. Oh, did. interesting. It's a classic Minecraft puzzle. Breaking the fourth wall here, aren't you, Mr. Computer? <laughs> oh, very interesting. It is. All right. So these are pistons, right? Yeah. Uh-huh. So I'm going to push you there. And then. Oh, yeah. Classic. Dude, classic Minecraft puzzle right there. Wait a minute. Uh, and then I got to do like that. And grab it. Yup. And then wait, where's that going? From there, though. Got it. Okay, so it's only sticky if it's got the green on it. Fancy resource pack stuff. I see. Uh Wait. Wait. Where do you? Have I messed up? Hold up. Was I not supposed to do that? Uh, wait. No. Wait a minute. Do that. That pushes that there. Hold up. Do we have any other double pistons over here? No. Yeah, not really sure where we go from here. Oh, wait. Duh. I just got to do this and then that. Right, there we go. That's why the double exists. You just use the piston as a block push. I got it. I got it. Boom. Boom. And easy peasy. See, this could have been made even more difficult, though, if you made it so, like, the stickies were all over the place. So you had to hit buttons all simultaneously. Otherwise, the block would have gotten pulled back to its original position. I'm just, like, informing the computer, you know, what it could have done to, to make me get stumped a little bit more or delay my progress. You know, whatever. Whatever it's going for. All right, we, we jump back into the vents. First try again, let's do it. Oh my God, it's too good. I'm basically Tom Cruise other than the part where I failed that. Mission impossible. Here we, come on. Tom Cruise and I, we're the same height. We should both be able to fit into these vents. No problem. Down, are right, you gonna maze, all right, you're gonna run a maze on me, aren't you? Oh God, I didn't want to stand up there. Wait, are we, I feel like one, Did you just, did I just reset myself? Is that what happened? Did I drop down the wrong spot? No, I didn't. Oh, thank goodness. I never liked Jerry anyway. My new best guard is Genevieve. Now it's personal. You don't just go and say that you don't like Jerry. Genevieve, I'll have you know, is a far less good guard than Jerry. Also, there are two guards here. What the heck? That's not how this is supposed to work. 
All right, I'll I'll give it to you. Genevieve did something all right there for being a guard that's not named Jerry, but at the same time, what? How do I get by? Huh. Yep. No, it totally didn't see me there. All right, we just follow along now. Everything is good. Okay, where's the turnaround point? Uh. uh okay, hold on. We go back in here. We're fine. Wait for the pass. Oh God! And we go. Woo! See what was I saying? Genevieve's no good. Jerry was far better. Jerry's always superior. Okay, even if I did get past Jerry as well, that's only because you repurposed and transformed Jerry from what he was initially, which was a beautiful slime, into your own minion. Not okay. Oh great! All of my guards failed me. I guess I am going to have to finish the job. This should hold you off. You mean the parkour that I've already done? Ha! You wish! I'll have you know. I was voted most likely to succeed at parkour in my senior yearbook at high school, okay? That was a real category in the in the yearbook polls. Absolutely. 100%. I wouldn't lie to you like that. I'm, I'm kind of a fan of parkour boss fights, though. I feel like I'm pretty good at them. He says as he probably misses the last jump. Nah. Release the bug. Release the bug? What's the bug? Is that the bug? That hasn't been released yet, though. It's uh, it's very much confined to the other side of this place. Are you just testing if I'm good at like leading my shots here? Is that what's going on? Because I'm pretty good. So far, four for four. Five for five. Six for six. I'm... I can dance all day. I'm not missing. There we go. Imbecile. You've opened up my electronics. Oh, thanks for telling me. I wouldn't have noticed otherwise. I would have been like, where am I going? All oh, right, over here. For sure, dude. I don't know. Oh, your electronics are actually a maze. Have I ever told you guys how much I like mazes? They're my favorite. Like, they're the best combination of activities ever. Also, especially if this is a maze where... Hey, we got it. Sweet. I was gonna say, especially if this is a maze where you have like crazy code teleportations and have to walk backwards, but didn't have to do that. I'm not sure I'm much more free now, if I'm being honest. I, I look pretty trapped in here. <laughs> At least I can probably... No, I can't break any blocks, so I'm, I'm stuck in here too. At least it's... I get to see the sun, so that's nice. Well, anyway, we've escaped the lab. I'd have been even better at it if I wasn't sick. So anyway, thank you very much for watching. Hopefully you've enjoyed. Make sure to like if you like. Check out the playlist in the description if you want to catch more maps. Subscribe if you're not already. And I'll leave it off there. I'll see you next time.